For 200 years, livestock production has helped shape this nation. So successful has this industry become that today more than half the meat and livestock we produce is exported. And part of that export story is the growth of the live sheep trade. The demand for live sheep exists because overseas customers specify that's what they need, either for cultural or religious reasons, or for practical reasons such as the need for fresh meat due to the lack of refrigeration. And while some people want the trade stopped, the fact is Australia's livestock export industry now sets the standard for world's best practice. Animal welfare is obviously vital on board a livestock vessel, not only because we have a moral obligation to protect those animals and to ensure that they're not stressed by the procedure, but also because there's a really strong relationship between animal welfare and product quality. The welfare of the sheep is paramount, from the selection of only those animals suitable for export to their preparation for the voyage. This pellet is used in the feedlot for five days prior to the animals going on the ship. It is the same ration that goes on board the ship. Sheep carrying more than an inch of wool are shorn. And vets from the Australian Government's Quarantine and Inspection Service monitor the loading, as well as travelling with the sheep on their voyages. Accredited Australian stockmen also travel on board vessels and lead the ship's crew in caring for the sheep on board. All vessels must meet strict requirements about the design and size of pens, animals per pen, food, water, ventilation and lighting. The proof that today's livestock exporting practices are maintaining a high level of animal welfare is in the numbers. Over 99% of the sheep arrive at their destination fit and healthy. This figure has improved by 21% since 2000. Australia also invests in improving animal welfare overseas. Middle Eastern feedlots such as this allows livestock constant access to feed, clean water and shade to ensure they stay in optimum condition for market. Those handling our stock receive training from Australian animal welfare experts and our industry is also helping to upgrade facilities such as ports, feedlots and abattoirs. This welfare program is managed by the producer organisation Meat and Livestock Australia and the exporters body LiveCorp. We've seen great improvements over the last three to five years, um, but our investment will continue. Back home, the live sheep export trade has a wide base. Western Australia, South Australia and Victoria all supply the trade. And thousands of farming families and communities across the country depend directly on the livestock export industry. If they stop the live export trade, overnight sheep prices would, would fall by half, if not more. Um, it would be devastating. Australia's livestock export industry, supplying quality food to the world, setting the benchmark for animal welfare and supporting Australian farming families and communities. <laughs>